All right, Aquarius, so let's just get into it. Remember that roles can be reversed. All right, if you have Aquarius, anyone in your chart is reading this for you. Let's see what your divine feminine energy is. Oh my gosh, come on. All right, divine feminine for Aquarius. Just let me talk about my connection with my guys that's strengthening me came out i'm an empress okay you guys may be following your intuition a lot or it's your intuition is strengthening let's see divine masculine divine masculine energy for queries is i was in denial you know somebody was in denial about the way they were acting the way they were carrying on. That's why they're saying, please be patient with me. Yeah. They were definitely being, um, they were in denial, whoever this person is. Okay. So let's see here what's going on. Someone here knows that a, <clears throat> that a situation or a person is their wish fulfillment. They want the will to turn in their favor when it comes to this situation. Okay. They don't want somebody to walk away or leave away. All right, but something is like taking a lot. Okay, yeah, so something is taking a lot. Something is feeling like it's just gonna end bad, maybe. Um, if they don't put in their all. Okay, someone here may be watching their money. Okay, someone here could be trying to give or they're waiting for somebody to come ask for some type of money. All right. Just so they can say no. What? Aquarius, what are y'all doing with it? <laughs> somebody is going to tell you no. Like, if you go to somebody and ask them for some money, they're going to tell you no, and they're going to they're gonna feel good about it. what y'all got going on but anywho king of swords nine of wands ace of swords and um eight of swords yeah this person could be single somebody here could be single being defensive towards a connection because they're investing in a, somebody here may be investing in a new connection or they're about to okay somebody here could be uh stuck in their feelings about a situation Somebody here could be causing conflict about ending and walking away from something. Ending, ending a connection and walking away. Yeah, it's like somebody here is trying to have a partnership or a connection here, but they're, they're being like standoffish. Or they're defensive. They don't mess. Somebody here doesn't realize that they're, 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 they're defensive. Somebody here could be operating out of the lower level emperor energy, controlling. They don't. Somebody here does not realize that they're unbalanced. Okay. They can't see this. Yeah, this could be you, Aquarius. That is this like this. You put too much burden on yourself, and you don't reach your you don't reach your full happiness because you may be chasing after something else that you think is your happiness. Um, for some of y'all, I'm feeling like your happiness is right there behind you or right there in front of you. But you're looking in another direction or something. I don't know. You're stuck in your feelings for sure. Okay. Some of y'all can't understand why y'all... Yeah, somebody, someone here cannot understand why they are always single or why they are still single or why they are like to themselves here. Someone here has no love, or they don't give themselves love. This is why there's no love here with the King of Swords and the Nine of Pentacles. Somebody here could have fire in their chart, or they're dealing with a fire sign Aries, Leo, Sagittarius person. Someone here they could feel emotion, but they might not take 
they may not take action based off of their emotion clearly with the king of swords sitting out here somebody feels like somebody people are always after them or out to get them so they try to get them first or they try to leave from the situation before it can even happen now somebody here is trying to go towards a connection they are going to choose to go towards a connection that is full of love but they need to sort some things out here because this person is trapped in their head yeah they can't even make a decision somebody here can't even make a decision because they they're trapped in their head somebody here is holding back and someone knows it someone can see this mm -hmm. and they're like how can we go into a new beginning or how can we have a new fresh start or something successful if you're imbalanced you're tripping over your own self or this person just stay tripping whoever this is whoever you may be dealing with they stay tripping okay or this could be you Aquarius take it however it resonates somebody here is um someone is trying to protect themselves from entrapment or feeling like they will lose a sense of themselves someone here is doing that because they someone here is doing that because they can see how something will turn out with a person wow this is ooh. yeah someone here is seeing a situation for what it is and another person is seeing the situation for what they want it to be and there can be no change implemented if someone is seeing something for what they want it to be rather than what it is realistically yeah and if they move forward somebody here is knowing if i let my guards down a tower moment is going to happen That's what somebody is saying. If I let my guards down, a tower moment is going to happen because this person going to catch me off guard with how they are mentally. Maybe their mental is going to catch me off guard if I make this decision to go towards them. It'll make, it may be a bunch of chaos. But I do want to commit to this person. I do want to love this person. I do want to offer this person some type of peace. This person is my focus. But they need to find balance. Yeah. So this emotional. If this is a relationship or whatever this is. It could take some time. Somebody here may have to go very, very slow within the connection. Somebody here definitely could have to just go slow. Somebody here may, if they commit too soon, somebody is somebody is going to um, be lacking or not have enough to give to the situation because they're moving too fast. They're, they're not balanced out enough. They need more balance or they're going to cause destruction. They're going to cause destruction because they are moving forward in this connection based off of illusions. Do they realize this? I'm not sure. I was in denial this year, so um, maybe they realize that now. Someone here, they definitely made a decision based off of a false, false reality. Something that was not real. Person can, this person could be trapped, feeling stuck, or they're about to take action and make a decision to end something so they can go after what they really want. Okay, so they could be ending this way of thinking or ending acting on decisions that they made that turn out bad. So this person could be around 
others who think this way. Like other people who they have no emotions. So this could be their family or community that they're in or wherever they are. They could be around other people who, who think the same way. Now this person is realizing for me to have success, I'm gonna have to work on myself. Cause what I want is, what I want and how I am, they too far apart. Like I'm gonna have to bring it together here. What I want, what I want and how I am does not match. So some changes need to be made. Queen of Wands. Thank you. Yeah. For me to grow up, I'm gonna have to put the work in. I'm gonna have to free myself mentally. That is what someone is doing. That is what someone is trying to do here. Or that is what someone is needing to understand. They have been lying to themselves. Somebody here has been lying to themselves. Seven of Swords. Let's see, Seven of Swords. Somebody could have been lying about being single. Now, I'm seeing somebody here could have been lying about being single. And then I'm also seeing somebody here was just lying to themselves about what they wanted based off the idea of it. But somebody here was definitely still in a connection and made a decision to go towards someone saying they were single just so they could like have an affair or something. Yeah, it's like somebody is really thinking. Somebody is really like, I need to change. I need to grow up. Yeah, and I need to put a defense around me and whoever I've been around has been acting this same negative way. I don't need to be around them. Because I know better. Some of y'all could be dealing with a Gemini, a Libra. Yeah, this person wants to definitely go towards something more stable. Something that brings them high honor. Something that brings them great fortune. All right, but this person could be concerned because this person could be concerned because this could be something new to them. They could just be used to toxic, negative things. They don't, they're not used to healthy. Clearly, they're not, they're, this person's not used to anything healthy. But they're about to fix themselves so that they can get, you know, accustomed to the healthy way of doing things. So they can have a new beginning, but it's going to take them some time. They're definitely going to... Somebody here could be dealing with someone that's a single parent. They could be a single parent. You could be a single parent. But they want to come towards you. They want to have a family. They want to be stable. They want to spoil you. They want to give you everything they want. They want to travel with you. They want changes to take place within you guys. It's positive changes to take place within you guys' connection. Okay, if this is a relationship. But it's going to take some time for this person to get it together. Because they've been going their whole life thinking this way. Or they, whatever they've been around, it's been instilled in them for so long. That it's going to take some time. Right, yeah, because what they were doing was not giving them successful plans. I mean, was was not giving them successful outcomes. It just wasn't working. They they made they didn't make pro um, proper decisions, or they made decisions and took action on things that had them bound. Okay, they caused them to be bound. Whoever they are around, this person can be like somewhere in the country somewhere where there's a lot of trees and they want to get away this person want to get away but wherever they were or whoever they were around they, these people were, they, didn't even think clear 
So if you're around them, then you're not gonna think clear. If you're around them long enough, Aquarius, if this is you or if it's your person, same thing goes for them. If they're around folks who don't think clear, but they think they are, or their decisions end them up in the wrong things, they're gonna start to think the same way as well. This could be the community they grew up in. But anywho, increasing material wealth or spiritual growth on top of the occupation, um, the two of pentacles and the ace of swords, that is this person becoming successful because they are putting the work in. They are putting the work in uh, with themselves. Bottom of the deck, the moon changes in your life. Changes are gonna happen in this person's life if they continue to put the work in bring balance into their life problems will be resolved okay they won't be dissatisfied in life anymore and they won't be indecisive or they won't just allow their um, life to ramble any type of way if they put the work in yeah somebody here is dealing with a person either your either your intuition is on point and you need to trust in it it could be a fair woman here okay you won't work achievement and success you may have you may be um, thought of, uh, highly thought of here. Okay, for some of you. Something could happen in July. Like something um, could pop off in July. But either you're this way or an Aquarius here is dealing with someone that is freeing them from depression, helping them listen to their intuition. Yeah, somebody here is definitely depressed and and anxious. Okay, but they're gonna have success getting out of this. Just put the work in. Somebody here needs to definitely just work on their spiritual growth. Cause somebody wanna have a stable foundation with someone that can be life changing for them. Somebody wants to be in love. They want to have a nice house. They want to have kids. Okay, something could take place in January. Or the Aquarius, you could be born. You could be a January Aquarius for some of y'all. Now, take care enemies are working against you. I feel like what this is, for a lot of y'all, the people who were, who wondering why they're single, wondering why they can't get what they want because they believing in lies or believing in the illusions okay the negative things gonna be coming in your mind while you're trying to fight and it's gonna go against what you're trying to do okay you need to stay strong you need to stay strong and you need to take care of your well-being overall okay if you want something new to come in ask for protection okay pray about it i mean yeah meditate medit <laughs> meditate meditate and contemplate here don't believe in the lies okay don't continue to believe in the lies that were told to you is what i'm picking up strong and another thing i'm picking up here is that person that was lying to you That came to you somebody here was being lied to the, the person was telling them they were single or they weren't doing something while they were singles or something like that this person is a bat like whatever they were trying to do it didn't work out Whatever happened didn't work out, okay? Something could be happening this month where you're like, because retrograde is about to start soon. Somebody here is, is their mind is going to be kind of all over the place. Okay, you need to definitely meditate and pray. Things could be working against you like your energy it could feel like something is off hidden secrets can harm you some of y'all dealing with the leo this person takes action somebody here 
if you're not dealing with a Leo, it doesn't matter what, who it is, but somebody here is going to have guaranteed success with someone that they're that's taking action on them. Or that's what this person wants. This person gives you some type of excitement. They could be born in July, but this person is, they keep their life in balance. Somebody that scales, it could be a Libra person or whatever, but and something could happen in July, like pop off good in July, but this person keeps their life in balance and they take action. Whoever this person person is, you you think highly of this person, or this person thinks highly of you. They could be coming to visit you, or you could be seeing this person. This is those are good. Those are good cards. Someone here, you're finding out the secrets to what it is you need, like to grow. Figuring those things out this month. News is on the way. So some of y'all may be waiting on some news to come in about something that could um, be a fresh start for you. Um, some of you guys could be moving physically, like literally moving somewhere else. Some of y'all could just be redecorating or redecorating your house. Somebody here could be um, getting news about some money coming in. Yeah, somebody could be definitely getting some good news about some money coming in. They could be going to take a vacation. Okay. Alright, so let's see. Get some good get some advice. Someone here knows news is on the way. They already know the news is because they their intuition is on point. <sighs> what do you have for me for my Aquarius? Confidence is the key to your success. Okay. Yeah, because you're going to have to stay confident because the answers you need are coming. Don't let your pride get in the way. Expect powerful change to happen. What do you need to release that old toxic way of thinking? And feeling like you're not good enough or whatever somebody that instilled in you or whatever community you were in that was feeding you a bunch of BS and lies okay, that you are now aware of or that you could have been holding on to. You need to let that go. You need to stay confident. And your decision to move forward and grow spiritually. Okay, don't worry about what somebody else is saying. Adjustments are required here. You and your loved ones are safe. You and your loved ones are safe. Be, be bold to make the first move and work through your fears here at the bottom of the deck. Yeah, some of y'all, y'all dreams. You have a vision, you have dreams, but you don't have a plan. You don't have a practical plan. So therefore, it's not working the way. It's all over the place. Okay. That was a word. Because luck is on your side. It's time to take action. A win-win outcome is forecast. You guys, this is good energy. You need to keep putting the work in. You need to continue to keep putting the work in. Be confident in what you're trying to do. Okay, make some adjustments here. Get get a little bit more practical. Okay, work through those fears. Don't worry about your loved ones. You and your loved ones, don't worry about your safety and things like that. Like, don't don't worry about that. Everything is good with it. Take some action. Okay, overall, you just need to take action. Once you start to learn these things, uh, learn what has been given to the decline in your life. Figure out what that is. Take action on that stuff. And then you're going to have a win-win outcome in your forecast. All right, Aquarius. So these were your messages. If this video resonated with you, please like, share, and subscribe. Um, yes, you guys can hit that notification bell too next to the su subscribe button. And let me know down in the comments what's been going on with you guys. And I'll talk to you guys later.